Leos! Subscribe! What up, players? Wobots tip in this mood. I'm gonna show you today how to paint quick and easy blonde hair for your line troopers. There's gonna be more steps in this if you wanna do character models, but for your regular line troopers, we are going to show you a technique that's really easy and simple to do and really effective on the battlefield. The finished product will look like this. Okay, so. That's what we are going for. So the four paints you're going to need to use are all Citadel, found, Citadel paints. We have Citadel Foundation paints, Calton Brown, Snake Bite Leather, Sunburst Yellow, and Denim Stone. First thing you're going to do is you are going to make sure that the hair you're painting over first is black. So Chaos Black is a, a good uh, starting point, base coat to use. So just paint over all the hair that you want to paint blonde, black, and then the first color is Calvin Brown. So I'm going to paint Calvin Brown on this guy's hair and then we'll come back and show you the step after that. Alright, so the next step we are going to do is painting over the Calvin Brown with snake bite leather. So we're gonna go do that. Snake bite leather, I'll show you what it looks like when we get back. After you've got your snake bite leather, you are going to make a mixture of snake bite leather and sunburst yellow. And just a little bit of sunburst yellow, you can really mix it to your own preference. You don't want too much because we don't want it to come out too yellow. So you always want to have more snake bite leather than sunburst yellow, just to give it more of a of a tinge. And at this point, you want to highlight more of the front edges and the sides, and not so much the entire hair uh, piece of hair as 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 you've been doing with the other layers. Okay. So again, that's a mixture of at least two to one, probably better three parts to one part of snake bite leather and sunburst yellow. Okay, so your blonde hair should look something like this at this point. The last step in the process is we are going to add a little bit of denim stone to our previous mix of snake bite leather and sunburst yellow. And we only want to hit the real edges and put some highlighting on the tips and near anything where the light would hit. So like up here at the crest of the head and on the sides where the hair is being, uh, if you have a model with an earpiece or a headpiece then anywhere where, that, where the light would hit as the hair is being moved aside by the hairpiece would be, or by the headpiece would be good. Okay, so again that's denim stone mixed into our previous mixture of snake bite leather and sunburst yellow. Alright, and there you have it. The amount of denim stone and how much you put on the hair will will determine, you know, how blonde and light colored it is. The main tip uh, is that, that I would say is that you don't ever want to go too yellow because yellow will look a little bit too fake. If anything, you want to go lighter with the denim stone, maybe add in more denim stone or even some bleach bone or skull white. Okay, so there's my Warboss tutorial on how to do blonde hair. Hope you liked it, and we'll see you in the next video.